Hi everybody, this is Christy from the Be The Light YouTube channel and I thank you so much for taking the time out of your busy and hectic day to come by and uh, give me your love. I send you love today, tomorrow, and continuously. Um, I have resonated with feathers. It's, I just always thought that they were, you know, beautiful. And um, um, I didn't actually have the deep understanding upon, about what a feather represents. And, but things like that, that we find to be beautiful or meaningful in our life, will always give us more insight as to who we are and what we should be doing in our lives. Um, everything really plays out. And when you continuously seek, you will find more understanding about what it means for your life. Um, so again, I am someone who resonates with, with Christ um, and his teachings. And the feathers were a sign from God. The very first time that I saw them was um, when he created a masterpiece of feathers on my vehicle. And this is, when I say saw them, I mean in a manifestation within my own world. And of course I've seen feathers, you know, on birds and things like that. But, um, and it began with me seeing feathers in my vision. But then when I was first opening up to my, um, my inner vision, I didn't quite understand what they were either because there were, there were just so many, so many feathers were everywhere and they were all piled on top of each other that it looked like a palm tree. That's what I thought they were, palm trees. So, um, but once I saw my vehicle, um, a year and a half ago or a year ago I knew exactly what it was and I knew then that it was God reaching me and has always been trying to reach me and I have the uh, um, there's a verse in the Bible about God surrounding you with his his feathers um, his wings um, so that is uh, what I take in when I see a feather that God is surrounding me and loving me and guiding me. And so early on in my awakening, my steps were guided with feathers. Every time I was doing something great and beautiful or had a beautiful thought and emotion or every time that I asked God for a sign, a feather was there for me. I found them as I was walking around um, or looking, you know, um, again, whether on my social media feed or on the television, every time I needed it, I had a feather. And I have a lot of feathers today. I have a collection of feathers and I have a lot that I have let go because they were so small or I decided to kind of blow them into the wind in hopes that someone else will find that feather and discover the hidden message within that feather. Um, I rarely get them any longer. I um, and you know, a normal person or a person who doesn't believe will probably just say, "Well, you know." Uh, you're not meant to find a feather sometimes or you know birds aren't always shedding their feathers or things like that but I know why I don't find feathers any longer because I am certain of who I am and I am certain of what I am doing and where I am going in my life um, I have chosen a path and I am not going to go away from this path. Um, so even from time to time, 
if I only see, receive one feather in six months or something, um, it's because I know I need it. I know it's because my spirit needs confirmation. But then when I don't, I know it's because I am set in this way. I am guided and I am in alignment. There is no difference and no separation between who I am, who God says I am, and what I am doing in my life. Um, so regardless if he is showing me a feather in my dreams, my visions, or if I see one out in the world, I know. Um, and if you are receiving feathers, even if it's change you're finding, coins you're finding outside, or heart-shaped leaves, or anything that you hold dear to your heart, that it just reaches and touches you in a way, you know, that is your confirmation from whomever, whatever it is that you believe in. And, um, but continue on with that and um, find that deeper meaning because it is something that is speaking to you. Something is trying to get your attention and it wants you to open up to what that message is. And then in time, when you are so in alignment with the message, who you are, and what it's meant to be, you'll eventually discover that it kind of moves away. You don't need it anymore. You know, God is always trying to, to uh, guide our steps. And whatever it is that we hold dear to our heart like a feather for myself, that's Him confirming my steps in my reality. Because it's so hard to know if we are going in the right direction when we are so t turned off from His footsteps. And now I don't need the confirmation of a feather because I feel his love guiding me every step of the way. This is Christy. Much love, health, and healing your way. I am bringing purpose to your life. Take care.